Well done. It's time for the Corny Show. It's Wednesday. Welcome one and all. Here we go. Yay! Time for some music! Mm. So, let's see, are we live yet here? Yes, we will be in a minute. There we go. bass and a drum track and what do we got here groovy five let's go to groovy three mm -hmm. yeah that's good so we start off with a bass line
that you are out there in the fresh air, enjoying the weather, listening to this music too. I don't sing the blues. machine which is on my loop station and uh, I've been playing with it a bit recently and I'm enjoying this new kind of a trick with the thing but um, I'm gonna start off with some gentle songs
mountain I know of a place It's a three day walk And a healthy pace And on my way there I know I'll find As I walk on a cloud and stone piece A piece of my eye I know a little cave They say it's where all the psychedelic people went to pray And on my way there I know I'll find The bright light of that sun won't make me blind A piece of my A piece of my a piece of my a piece of mine. Peace in my home, peace in my heart. I carry the peace with me, and I know that it's a star.
the drum machine kicked in there on the last beat. Magically enough, I had no idea why that happened, but it did, and it was fun. And that's that lovely song, Peace of Mind. Yes. Indeed. Ah, so, um, let me see, I'm going to do Vishnu next. Um, just in the continuation of the nice songs, the gentle songs, then we'll do some jumpy up stuff. Thank you. 
They were walking on the field And there was something In their eyes A recognition I could meet I'm not so foolish I would call myself a god I'm not so lonely I saw Muhammad, I saw Moses in Christ And we were seeing each other, we were all blessed twice And there was Thor and Loki Dancing at the bar with the whole godly crew. And not so foolish, I would call myself a god. And not so lonely, I would say, be sure I am not. She was walking with the Magdalene They were so colorful They were such a scene And there is Bridget And Tara and Isis I saw the divine radiate from their faces And not so foolish I would call myself a god
finish nicely. Yes, I saw Vishnu. My song about you are my gods. Um, people are my gods. Trees and plants are my gods. Yes, so it's springtime, isn't it? Um, I should do a cup of tea. Mmm. Mmm. Ah, cup of tea. So my next song is going to be the cup of tea and then I'll get on to some of the new songs. Or should I leave it for a while? I'll do it now. I'm in the mood for that right now. Yes, so um, if you've got a cup of tea beside you, that's fine. If you've got a glass of wine or brandy or hot chocolate with brandy or whatever it is, whatever tipple you're drinking with you and your loved ones, wherever you are. This song is about that love together. Me. 
Now you taught me how to make a perfect cup of tea And every time I look at you, your eyes, they smile at me Now you taught me how to make a perfect cup of tea And every time I look at you, and always when I think of you And whenever I feel you in my heart Jump into the do it, shall we? We're all family. Or new songs, new songs, old songs, new songs, old songs, new songs, new songs, new songs, new songs. So I've been working on a song, um, a version of "I Fought the Law and the Law Won." Except this one, it goes, "They fought the law and they won." And it's about some friends of mine who um, uh, did a protest outside Bristol Court, Bristol Magistrates Court in January this year. And uh, it, the, 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 there was four people who were picked out of the crowd who were um, uh, 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 being in court for toppling the slaver statue in Bristol. And... Um, uh, and my, these four people, one of them who's a friend of mine, went along to do a protest outside the court. Of course, this is in January, so COVID was in full swing at the time. And, uh, uh, or maybe it was a bit earlier. But anyway, uh, they went outside the court to do um, some protesting. And they were doing all the distancing. They had masks. They were doing everything. And uh, they got arrested. Um, and they got arrested under the COVID regulations, um, but they were using the COVID regulations to ban protest. And, um, and they weren't actually breaking any of the regulations whatsoever, because uh, they were all masked up and COVIDed up and did the whole thing properly. Um, so I wrote, I wrote this. Uh, let's see how we go. So yeah, it's they fought the law and they won. Sarah and Wes. Yes. Uh, whatever tune, just let me know. Um, yeah. So um, I'll go back to this again.
cases that were saying that were saying you can't use coronavirus laws to ban protest. So family, I'm going to play family for you. Let me see what drum pattern will we put onto this one.
Golden's are my 
family, the Namibians are my family, the Tanzanians are my family, the Zimbabweans are my family, Los Tato is my family, the Canadians are my family, the Cubans are my family, the Jamaicans are my family, the Haitians are my family, the Trinidad are my family, the Peruvians are my family, the Brazilians are my family, the Chileans are my family, we are one family right across this globe. the drum machine it's like I've got a whole band there and a drummer who keeps time <laughs> which is lovely and uh, yeah might as well keep going with this vibe with the old machineries and um, I'm going to do the bears in the woods Sometimes it's like that, definitely, uh, Jeannie. Sometimes we're, we can feel closer to whatever is natural out there than to other people sometimes. It's just, uh, we're all living in a very stressed society. You know, yes. So that song was for um, uh, everyone, really, but really especially for... Um, uh, Sarah and Wes. Yes, I hope you enjoyed that. Um, I really did. That was the first time I've done that uh, with a drum machine and it was pretty bouncing along. I was quite enjoying it. Hello, Christian. Christopher, hello. Don't worry about not seeing it um, uh, live and dropping in late and stuff. It's lovely that you care so much. Um, it really is. So... The bears in the woods.
songs and um, there's a song I've got which I love at the moment I'm really enjoying it and it's called we all uh, we all grow together we all learn together um, and it's here somewhere yes and then after that I'm going to do um, springtime because that's like springtime is now spring is a long time it's between winter and summer and in England it can go wibbly wobbly either way weather here changes you know i remember some people were still talking about this wet, wet weather and saying you know climate change and i said well i remember in the early 2000s a lot of small worlds the may is the may were it was really wet you know really really wet and um so yeah so um yes so i'm not going to do i'm not going to do this one with a drum machine because it's nice doing it like this Thank you. 
unanimity. Your neighbors apes to solve logic problems. Pressure to be creative blocks creativity. Pressure to perform blocks new learning. I'm 62 and I'm still learning all the time. I am, I'm learning all the time and it's just brilliant. <laughs> yes, yes, we have April weather at this time. Uh, so the, shift, the, the seasons have shifted a bit. And, and you see, that's the thing is the weather does shift and biology isn't always the same. It's always changing. The natural world is always changing. There's lots of things happening. And to live well in it, we have to be sensitive to those ch changes and we have to be able to see them and be creative in how we respond to them and watch what our responses do. And that's all about learning. And learning is just a biological a reality. You know, we don't need schools to learn. You need schools to train a population. That's a different thing, a totally different thing. But, uh, but you know, and, and there are good things in schools. I'm not knocking schools completely. Um, but there are some things in schools that really shouldn't be there and we need to look at those. And you know, like I was doing, reading some research uh, last year and there was a, a couple of surveys of school kids in England and uh, one in five children were experiencing being bullied in the school premises. And it's like, dude, that's not acceptable. That can't be happening. Our children cannot be put into that kind of an environment where they have to deal with that. that that, you know, and there's no, like these children were distressed. It wasn't like they were being bullied and then it was being sorted out. No, they were being bullied and it wasn't being sorted out. And that's just not acceptable. You know, for me, that's just totally, totally unacceptable. Yes, indeed. Uh... <laughs>
Sometimes I like to just play little goodly noodly bits like that. It's really nice. So I've done that song already. Okay. Ah, yes. Here's a song that I don't do that often, and it's called Don't You Tell Me What To Think, and it relates to that last song and to what I've just said about um, uh, education. And, uh, like... An adult should never tell a child what to think, and certainly not with a reward or punishment, you know, kind of dynamic. Like if you get the right answer, you're going to be rewarded and approved, and you get the wrong answer, you're going to get disapproved and be punished. That's all really, 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 really awful. So I wrote this song about that, and it's called Don't You Tell Me What To Think.
So yeah, just a little short one, that one. Don't you tell me what to think. You know, that's the thing about like, proper news reporting doesn't tell you what to think. It says, look, here's the information. You decide what you want to think about it. But what we see in our newspapers is mostly telling people what to think. And there's a friend of mine many years ago, he used to call, he used to call the television, he called the television is telling you what to think. And, um, and he was correct. He was right. He had it on the money. He was definitely on the money on that one. So, um, yes, springtime is planting time. It's time to get out in our gardens. I think we'll go on to some beets for that. Yes. So. So. Summertime is eating Tom, I'm eating from my garden. I pick 
the peas, I pick the leaves, I ain't for solid, it's all very clean. I pick the berries, I pick the fruit, I watch it grow, and it's so cute. So springtime is planting time, get out in your garden. Springtime is planting time, get out in your garden. Springtime is planting time, get out in your garden. Springtime is planting time, put tea in your garden. Autumn time is harvest time, gathered from the garden. Autumn time is story time, building up the larder. Winter time is resting time, growth goes out of the garden. Winter time is costing time, is turning in the garden. Free food is freedom, free food is freedom, free food is freedom. If you've got a garden, free food is freedom, free food is freedom, free food is freedom. Every family should be given an allotment. And every school should be teaching children how to grow things and how to make things and how to use this lovely planet that we've got. You know, even in the cities, we could be. You know, when 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 I'm looking forward to sometime in the next ten years when there's no more combustion engines and it's all electric and. Uh, and they uh, and they've solved the problem of um, uh, blast, microplastics coming off of tires, because that has to be solved as well. And cities become clean again, and then we can grow food in the cities, and that would be just fantastic. Uh, that uh, cities become places that grow food as well as everything else. So, I have a song uh, kind of about that, and it's called "Freedom to Grow." And it's about the sunlight and the water and how that feeds us all. And it's called Freedom to Grow. So I want to do that song for you now with a different, slightly different beat. And Thank you. 
Evaporating water forming clouds The heat of the sun drives the wind And the clouds then rain onto the land Freedom to grow with nature intended Freedom to grow with nature intended Freedom to grow with nature intended Life and recycling Table, the lakes, the rivers that flow to the sea. The cycle of water is so fresh for life. Continue it forever and it's always for free. The water feeds all our lives. The animals, the plants that we eat. Without this water we would surely die. I love this process that is so free. the sun and I love all the weather and uh, and I love wellies and I love good rain gear and I love being sheltered <coughs> I don't like being wet and tired and cold but it can happen it has happened many many times many times <laughs> to another so do what you love it's your gift to the universe I like to sing that and uh, for me doing what I love is about something it's not something I get from, from it's something about myself it's something that I it's about being truthfully honest about myself and what I want to be doing um, so you know like when I was a parent you know like washing nappies um, you know, uh, I love doing it. I love being able to wash them. Um, the stink was awful, you know, because I mean, we didn't do throw in nappies, we did w w wash nappies. And, um, but I love being able to do that. And, you know, when my children were ill or uh, sick and I looked after them and they puked all over the place and I cleaned it up and when the baby was small and it would go on my shoulder and puked all over me. It's so like, I love the fact that I would go, yuck, that's yucky, but I would look after it. And I love being a parent, you know, uh, and so, and over time, I just learned to love being able to do all those things. And that translated into like, I love being, you know, when I was working in festivals, cleaning the toilets, being able to clean the toilets, being willing to clean the toilets. That was an act of love to do, you know, like. <laughs>
you love what you give to the universe, do what you love what you give. Do what you love what you give to the universe, do what you love what you give. Do what you love what you give to the universe, do what you love what you give. Do what you love what you give to the universe, do what you love what you give. Do what you love what you give to the universe, do what you love what you give. Now what you see is what you get, I'm making you disappear. Water is water, blood is blood, and you are you, my dear. And what you feel is what you feel, and nature is so clear. Trust the truth, and then your heart is not your own, my dear. When you do what you love, and you get to your rest, do what you love, and you give. Do what you love, and you get to your rest, do what you love, and you give. Do what you love, and you get to your rest, do what you love, and you give. Do what you love, and you get to your rest, do what you love, and you give. Do what you love, and you get to your rest, do what you love, and you give. Do what you love, and you get to your rest, do what you love, and you give. There is a mind within the heart, it's quick and true, sending empty feelings around us and boring you. And what you feel is what you feel, follow that, my dear. The path of growth before you, your heart stands clear. When you do what you love, and you get to your rest, do what you love, you give. Do what you love, and you get to your rest, do what you love, you give. Do what you love, and you get to your rest, do what you love, you give. Do what you love, and you get to your rest, do what you love, you give. Do what you love as you get to universe, do what you love as you give. Do what you love as you get to universe, do what you love as you give. Do what you love as you get to universe, do what you love as you give. Do what you love as you get to universe, do what you love as you give. Do what you love as you get to universe, do what you love as you give. Do what you love as you get to universe, do what you love as you give. Yay! So, um, we're coming towards the end of the set, and um, we're going to do 20 minutes. So I'm now going to do that beautiful song that I have um, about Jacinda Ardern and uh, the wonderful government and people of New Zealand and Australia and Vietnam and all those countries that are doing a zero community transmission who are saying, look, we're not going to spread this virus among us. And that's the best way we can think of of protecting all our people and our loved ones. And they're perfectly right. It's exactly the right thing. Don't spread it. If you spread it, it's going to cause problems. If you don't spread it, problem solved. Does mean that they're going to have to like be tight on their borders. And if you want to go visit them, you got to spend two weeks in a hotel to make sure you're not carrying a fucking bug with you. That's fair enough. I mean, Given the situation, you should be doing that anyway. You should be delighted to do that and saying, I'm so glad I'm not bringing that bug to you. Do you know what I mean? Like, really, gosh, that people are complaining about that. It's like just mind boggling. It does my head in. Anyway, anyway. So, uh, <clears throat> yes, Mary Ellen, lovely to see you there. And Sue's, hello, my lovelies. And much, much love to you too. Um, it's lovely. Uh, I like that we, 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 we know each other through so much loveliness on the fields. And over the last year, you've been hammering away and I've been hammering away, been working, doing the things we do to spread the love. Um, yeah, and I hope you're, you're well and I hope you're going to enjoy lovely, safe visits um, uh, and, 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 and stuff as, as time goes by. So this song is about... Um, Jacinda Ardern Yes, make COVID history. <laughs> hey, that's brilliant. Yeah, don't be spreading it. Don't be spreading the blues.
all the vaccines they need give everybody um, uh, the tools to stop the spread and um, and uh, then we won't even need the vaccine if we do that correctly yes indeedy so we're coming to the end of the set and um, so I'm going to do ride on and then I'm going to do um, sunny or I might do an Irish song I'll do right on because I like that. Right on is a farewell song.
with you no matter how I wanted to.
go with you no matter how I wanted to. Right on, see you. I could never go with you no matter how I wanted to. So there we go. Another week, another set. And uh, thank you all for being with me and for leaving comments and for watching later on. And I've figured out how to put it up onto YouTube and to um, give you markers so you can go to particular songs. And um, yes, I once again, I really, really enjoyed this set and thank you for listening and giving the feedback. It's very, I appreciate it very, very, very much. And um, so I hope you all have <clears throat> A really lovely nurturing week between now and the next gig. Um, lots of love to all of you. Stay safe. And let's not spread anything but love. Thank you.